Good morning, children. Let us continue chapter 7. Asia, Climate, Natural Station and Wildlife. Asia is divided into various natural vegetation regions which are based on the richness and the type of flora found in each of them. The word flora means plants and fauna means animals. So children, various natural regions of Asia are Tundra region and Tega region. Both you can see in the map, they are found in the northern part of Asia. Tundra is shown by grey color and taiga by dark green color. Then deciduous vegetation is found in the central part of Asia. Steppes are also found on the west and eastern part of Asia. Then highland vegetation. Highland means on the top, top of the mountains and mixed forests occur mostly in the central part of Asia which are mountainous region. Equatorial rainforest as the name suggests area around the equator. So this type of vegetation is found in the areas which are around the equator near the equator. Desert vegetation is found in the desert regions of Asia, Arabian desert and Thar desert. Now children, the first region is Tundra region. The word Tundra is a Russian word meaning marshy plain. Tundra can be divided into two parts, Arctic Tundra which is found around the North Pole and second is Alpine Tundra which is found on the mountain peaks. This is Arctic Tundra around the North Pole and north of the Arctic Circle. So, Arctic Tundra. It is a region of cold treeless plains with permanently frozen subsoil. Box and shallow lakes are formed when snow melts during the summers. Children, box means an area of wet muddy ground which is too soft to support a heavy body. Few plants bloom for a short spell. You can see here. Now species of plants are lichens, mosses, sedges and some grasses occupy favorable locations. Animals like polar bear, you can see here, reindeer, arctic foxes, seals and walrus are found. Here the animals are fur-bearing animals so that they can protect themselves from the severe winter conditions. Taiga region, it extends from Siberia to the Northern part of Japan. Trees have needle like leaves, deep roots, thick bark, and cone shaped seeds. You can see here they have what cone shaped, these are cone shaped plants, so known as conifers trees. Species of trees are pine, spruce large, cedar and fur. Animals like sable, mink, polar fox, bear, lynx and squirrel are found here. Now children, next type of vegetation is deciduous vegetation. Also known as Northeast China Plain Deciduous Forest. Manchurian mixed forest in China. It is also known as Central Korean deciduous forest. The vegetation found here is oak, camellia, 
बीच मैग्नोलिया दिस फ्लावर इज ऑफ मैग्नोलिया कैंफर एंड चेस्टनट एनिमल्स लाइक मंकीज एंड फॉक्सेस बर्ड्स लाइक पैरट्स एंड पिकॉक्स आर फाउंड हियर now children the next vegetation type is tropical deciduous vegetation tropical deciduous vegetation can be divided into tropical deciduous and tropical monsoon regions the tropical monsoon forest experience a slightly heavier rainfall than the tropical deciduous vegetation this vegetation is found in the countries like india laos pakistan bangladesh myanmar thailand vietnam cambodia southern china trees like teak sal sesame and mango are found animals such as elephants monkeys bears deers apes lions and tiger are found in the tropical deciduous uh, forest region uh, the peculiar characteristics of this vegetation is that they shed their leaves once in a year during the dry season and starts growing leaves again at the start of the rainy season now the next vegetation is desert vegetation as the name suggest desert vegetation means vegetation which is found in the desert region so the regions which include this vegetation are tibet mongolia arabian peninsula and the area around the caspian sea tibet is here mongolia is here now plant cover in desert is sparse and they are either moisture combating means they have waxy deep rooted thorny shrubs or sporadic stunted trees the common trees are date palm date palms cactus kikar babool animals are camels horses mules lizards and insects now children the next vegetation type is equatorial vegetation as the name suggest this vegetation is found in the areas which are around the equator this so it includes countries like malaysia indonesia and the southern part of philippines the characteristic features of the vegetation in this forest is they have dense for canopy dense undergrowth trees are hardwood trees with broad leaves trees found here are mahogany ebony rosewood cinchona coconut rubber creepers and climbers tall grasses and bamboo also grow between the tall trees and make the forest very dense very little sunlight reaches to the crown as the leaves act as a canopy canopy means you can see the uppermost layer is forming the shed like umbrella does not allow the sunlight to reach to the ground so these trees they fight among themselves to grow higher and higher to get the sunlight one more thing in this forest region as you can see 
the trees are of different height they represent multi story building okay so at least three stories you can see one two and the third story animals such as monkeys and apes birds such as various species of birds are found here reptiles like lizards snakes and crocodile are found here now children question aaya i'll give you time to answer these questions and we will discuss them later first question which natural region has permanently frozen subsoil second trees of which natural vegetation has needle like leaves third question near the type of vegetation found in india fourth name two countries where equatorial rain forests are found fifth by what name deciduous vegetation known as in korea right i'll give you 5 uh, minutes to write down these answers we will discuss that thank you children for the class